this is Joshy Boggs. Um, uh, let's play. Uh, Barry Stars. So I have to hit load, right? Oh no, there we go. Resume. load but I, I felt like just clicking where's in. Alright, what are we up to now? I finished talking to Anha and I guess we're up to Gyu Hak Lee. Um alright let's do it. Gyu Hak from fan to hater. Sung Young seems emotionally invested with Do Yoon and Ju Young. He might be a fan of at least one of them. What do you think? It could be an old fan. <clears throat> Yeah, either an old fan or Ju Young's or of Ju Young's or mine. Well, I never made my debut, so actually, most of the former fans turned against me. That's because of the misunderstanding. Oh, is that what you believe? Switch a key. What choice do I have? You saved my life. I will always believe you. Ah. Oh. You're embarrassing me. Huh? What do you mean? I've always done like this. Hmm? When are you going to stop? Probably never. Aww. That was adorable. Alright. Specific. Uh, the internal affairs of Beastars that Sung blabbered about were all related to episodes 6 to 9. Maybe they part participated in production of these episodes. What do you think? Uh, fans begin with episode 9. Um, hmm. episode 6 or about team missions. Ah. You've got some good memory. I can't forget it because that's what, that's when I made it to the finals. Hopefully. Anything that comes to your mind. Hopefully. Let's see. I had no time to care about other matters because things were so hectic back then. That was... By then, everyone was slinging mud on their own. <coughs> Yu Huck, uh father was revealed to be Byung Lee. He. The overheated tension near the end of the preliminaries. Both the contestants and viewers went mad. This feels like it's changing the subject, but this, this shows that I'm paying attention to what we're talking about. Um, Oh, Gyuhak has had a trouble listening to which story? Um, well, it seems like this is what he was talking about. Yeah, I feel like this, this shows I'm paying attention, but I'm not, I'm not quite sure Maybe, maybe I'm supposed to be answering the question, which means that maybe I should, I should click on this. But I'm gonna go with this one. We certainly got heated at the end of the preliminaries. Not just us, but also for the viewers. At the end, we were nearly suffocating one another. Ah, I got it. Yeah, we were both mentally and physically. I knew what to expect from the beginning. But it was a different kind of incident. Yu Huck scratched the tip of his nose. Objective. However, we managed to make it to the finals. And see where he's gotten us now. Estimated age. As Sung Young uh, criticized Kye Sung and, and Inha. Must be older than the two of them. Based on what they say about Gyu Huck, it might be about Gyu Huck's age. Kugon. Assume they're. Bagyone. That sounds a little vague. Kugoya. I can only special speculate for now. Anna. I don't know much, but I think there were many college students among the staff members. The whole place got quiet once the vacation season was over. <clears throat> Yu Huck briefly fell silent as he rubbed his chin. 
I don't have anything else to say on this matter. Um, you should ask Sale about the issues concerning uh, the staff. I'm sorry I couldn't help you. Yeah, that's you mentioned Sonyoung's death. That's a little fact. Even before it was reported on the news. Any way for them to have gotten that info from the scene of the accident? There must be a way. Unless he's actually here. They ran their mouth even before the announcement was raised. They might have gotten lucky with bluffing. No, dummy! He's been getting lucky consistently. You're right, they were just guessing. No! God damn, these two idiots are stupid. Is that what it's actually going to turn out to be? Is the story actually going to try to tell me that S. Sung Young's predicted everything perfectly? <laughs> By luck? Even who would die? The two of them fell silent while staring at each other. Well, we clearly made some progress with this. We weren't wasting our time, after all. We can at least determine which direction we should head towards. Many of the newly hired staff members were fans of Beloved. Some even cheered after meeting Ju Young in person. I saw some of the staff members who came to see Ju Young. Weren't you also visited by some of your fans? Only briefly in the beginning. The band wasn't that popular. I don't I didn't think I'd make it to the finals. <sighs> Not something I want to hear from you. I'm actually complimenting you. Well, thank you then. Uh -huh. And that's why I want to cheer you up. And, that, and that's why I want you to cheer up. I don't know. I know what you mean. Let's pull ourselves together. <laughs> right. It's not until we make it out of here safely. And once we do, it's going to be a new beginning for us. The official Beastars account manager was a big fan of Beloved. Good sir. I understand that staff members can be fans too, but... There's no need to be open about it. In Ju Young's case, it was one of Beloved's fans. Then he might hold a grudge against Ju Young. Not really. He said he was glad to see her in person. Why would he attack her if he liked her so much? <clears throat> you have quietly rubbed his chin. Hmm? Why? What if he was lying? Maybe he was glad to see her in the audition because he thought he could harm her. Huh? What? There are no clues to indicate that. I know, but everyone lies. They hired new staff members after the third preliminary round finished. Most of them were university students on vacation. I guess we should finish these. There's only seven left. Uh, it'll be a slight deal, but it'll be fine. <clears throat> so let's talk about the new part-timers. That's when we began to see lots of new faces. Yeah, the place was packed for a while. Yeah, only for a while. Most of them were all gone after a few months. But they also met the conditions, and that means... Gyu Hyuk uncrossed his arms after pausing for a minute. We don't have enough information. I think we should question Sale for additional information. I did already. 
You might feel comfortable, but this you might feel uncomfortable, but this does concern the staff. Alright, let's keep going. What about the undergrad staff? Um, university student part-timers. They quit when the new semester began. They probably worked here there until episode seven. A few part-time timers still remain. What do you think, you Huck? If he wasn't planning on taking time off school, he could only work for a short term. None. I also worked a lot of part-time jobs to buy musical instruments. And after that, I had to work to buy bigger prices, pieces from, for my band. Hmm? I had to work for... Jesus. I'm so sleepy. After that, I had to work to buy bigger pieces for my band. Okay. What about your school tuition? <coughs> I just fooled around. Uh, I didn't really care anything. I didn't really care anything but the band after I graduated. I'm supposed to say care about, I'm sure. Switch a key. You went to music. That's not relevant stuff. You got lightly patted on patted though you should you should say patted him on the arm. You can't just say pat us pat us without giving a detail. Uh, you knew what you were doing. I assume you patted him on the arm. Patting him on the head would be very condescending. It was all about music. He also went to several other places. I want to hear about the other places. I'm not sure exactly what that means. So let's try this one. And your son. Not so much like that. I did consider other options. Huh? Like what? Could go on. Having multiple jobs. I wasn't sure if I could make it with my band alone. Though you scratch this nose. Could it it's important to have a backup plan. You've continued working, including participating in B Stars. And I admire you for that. I only wasted time pondering on what to do with my life. Alright, I think the other way would have been better as a bonus. Uh, I didn't get a negative, and that's good. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's get a little further. This is good that I'm getting sleep because I can go to sleep soon. But we'll finish these. Okay, group chat rooms. Staff members join their own group chat rooms. Something like stuff has been shared via those chat rooms. What do you think? I'm sure the staff members have their own chat rooms. But I'm not sure how active the members are since I have no access to them. They would never invite the contestants into their chat rooms. I don't know about messengers, but somebody talked about creating a chat room for contestants during our training camp. Sale. Oh, I'm just thinking about this. Sale might be on that chat room, right? He's got his device there. And it might be a whole con conspiracy. S. Sung Young might be like a whole group of them, uh, like like a bunch of deranged, uh, you know, a bunch of deranged, uh, uh, like uh, workers that that ha that are like working together. I don't know. It's kind of crazy. That'd be interesting though. Creating group chats was a trendy thing at the time. Cool. Really? I had no idea. Good game. He talked to several contestants, but things didn't work out. Really? Who did he talk to? Hmm. It was Anna and probably Hesan. Kromion. No wonder why it didn't. Why did he choose those two out of all the nice people? Switch a key. Some contestants would be eliminated, so it would be awkward to be in the same space with them. Kretsu. 
The messenger app on the watch didn't have the function to invite a group. Maybe it's because of what you said. Nowadays it's a basic but essential function. I'm pretty sure. It's like the show didn't want. Okay, um, four more. Amrito. There are many fatal. Krongokata. Why are there are many fatal incidents? These are so fatal. Accident. Grande. With expressing yourself on fair, right? But it's a problem if they go too far with excessive information. That's how they gain more attention. You have nodded after a brief pause. I guess that's how you end up giving away more information. Some people enjoy other people's attention. We are not that different from them. We already gave away lots of information. Right, including the information which we didn't agree to provide. Yeah, maybe. S. Sung Young could be one of them. Ugh. What am I doing? So tired. Uh, managing the. What do you think? I guess it was inevitable if he was a sh as a short-term contractor in the first place. Depending on the situation, I depending on the situation, odd jobs also require lots of menial work. You don't of course, someone must take care of the petty tasks. But they shouldn't treat people as disposable based on the magnitude of work. You have nodded. Sung Young wasn't the type to assign work to someone and just entrust them with it. That's true, but... Wasn't it a bit different for sale, though? A sudden remark. You're right, considering how she used to walk all over him. <sighs> Actually, that part was the, pro was the problem. <laughs> right. I'm sure the staff members were unhappy with her. Except student part-timers, the only staff members who left B-Stars were the staff member who quit before the finals, and the member who got fired after the profile incident. <laughs> So, I have to be sorted out too, huh? Chris. Someone got fired during the profile accident. But why hold a grudge against us? We had nothing to do with it. Hmm. We pointed out the, the profile mistakes, but knew nothing about what happened afterwards. Most people knew about it after a long time. That's true. The people responsible avoided blame. Only one person got fired. That's about it. Yuhak nodded quietly. That can't be a reason for harassing us. Okay. Uh, Chu Young was reprimanded for answering the staff's questions without a second thought because it was posted in various websites. <sighs> How unfortunate. I'm sure that Chu Young said it was because she was glad to see them. Anadu. She would never have expected it would get leaked. But I guess it didn't lead to a serious problem. I think it was a bit risky. It could have prompted more serious comments. I don't think she would have fallen for it, but... She could have let her guard down since it was a question from the staff. yu -Huck suddenly changed the topic as if something had crossed his mind. Have you ever felt it? Even the staff members preferred certain contestants over the others. Chris. I, especially during the finals. 
They seem cranky toward their favorite contestants' competitors. People that started more recently seem way more unprofessional about it. I guess that would make sense. All right, Julian is next. Let's save. Cool, it's not working well. That's that's what's going on here. All right, I can go back here. Um, why is this still here? What is that? seems emotionally too young. 